Hello. Thanks for meeting me here. I know. Time is in constant fluctuation. Pardon my makeup. I was in a rush. So. What's on your mind? I will speculate, and many people did speculate, that life is between order and disorder. Okay? But how? Uh, so life is, is at that critical place. Life appears at that critical place because life needs order to sustain its processes, but life needs disorder to be adaptable to changes. Talking about criticality, what it is, what it means, interesting things that happen around a, a critical point. The critical point being the point at, at the end of a phase transition. In a complex system, showing criticality, you have like increased connectivity in communication in the system the dynamics of criticality being observed in the brain it's also observed in quite a lot of natural systems there's a hypothesis the molecules that form um, proteins life occurred in in a quantum critical state these, these kind of systems self-organize to criticality meditative states and ones on, on psychedelic and drugs, those two brain states are found to increase criticality. I want An to interesting think about thing about how the this system happens on the personal level state, um, is how that this becomes very personal sensitive to noise. In the and sense of that a critical experience, system being, being sensitive to things, medium, there's a interest connecting in, in what concept being sensitive to is exciting parts of the brain and psychedelics modulate the neurochemistry as a way to further tune your brain to a critical point.
What is criticality opening us to, making us sensitive to? Is that where I'll discover the significance of criticality? Is it even what I'm being sensitive to? Or just how I'm becoming sensitive to things? We have several dimensions where we could reach these critical states or critical points. And it seems to me that it's when you, it's kind of, you are reaching these points or you're approaching these points. It's kind of all these critical points align. So it's kind of, you um, um, unlock one of them, more, more than one of them, or a group of them at least. So you are kind of like very resonating with this. Focus on on the fact that if the, 
So I want to search for the comfort zone and the boundary. Well, here we are at the majestic, beautiful Venice Beach, California. I've determined one way to push to get to the boundary of my comfort zone is to interview random people. This is the first one that came to mind. Yeah. <laughs> Would you be open to making any sounds, like with your hands or feet or voice? You don't have to. Yeah. All right, you want to you make one for me? Okay. Uh, Ease yourself into it. I'm down. I'm freaked out by this film, but I'm interested. I'm working on the transformation. I'm in love. I'm down for this. Yeah, I'm down for this. California, Mata Tachka High, Mata Tachi 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 Mata. First one that came out. Cupping, now clapping. And it comes like a walk around. Transformation is the only. We are now coming to a critical point. It's the ending I get so caught up on. I think about it the whole time. It's like even the thing starts and it's all about the end, isn't it? Why is it gotta 
get all the attention. is half empty. Pessimism. Am I a pessimist? <sighs> Pessimistic things will work out. Pessimistic That I'll have a good time. That I'll live a long time, I guess. That I'll feel fulfilled and okay. Thank you.